At least my visitors have been kind enough to leave the gate open. Time I'd bought had been going real cheap. If I was gonna plant the rest of those explosives, I had to do it now. of the explosives. I just hoped it was enough to bring down the building and all the evil in it. Vai, vai, rápido, rápido, vai! Who wants to take a shot? You see what this is? Come on, anybody? Want to be a hero? I got nothing to lose. Let's do it. Que porra que tá acontecendo aqui? Oh, Senor Nevis. What the fuck is your problem, man? <laughs> my problem? My problem? Want to know what my problem is? You're turning humans into glue! That's what my fucking problem is! I don't know what you're talking about, American! All I know is what I hear about you. You bodyguard for the Brancos. They are all dead. You help the poor. Today, many of them dead. You are a proper American hero. At least I fucking tried. Well done with your effort. The whole city is grateful. The great American savior of the poor. That's right. You think you made any difference? You think stopping this legitimate business venture is helping anyone? We pay for everything. We have the record. Oh, so people can sell their livers, their hearts, their eyeballs? You're insane, you sick fuck. We kept people safe in the city. Decent people. Safe. I know a lot of powerful people. Well, your powerful people aren't gonna help you out of this one, buddy.
see your happy tourists smiling. <laughs> doing here I came back I can see that but why to save you oh yeah real hero listen Just now come with me Max to Brazil It'd be a chance to play the fall guy in a plot that my boss his brother's hatching to profit from the selling of human organs yeah it'll be perfect for you what are you talking about I don't know nothing about human organs man Victor and Marcelo are trying to teach Rodrigo a lesson get into loosen the purse strings and the family money they pressured me into doing it. Do you want to die? I came back for you. I did my best. I'm having a kid, Max. I gotta go. Fuck you. Sure. Later. Now, let's go. Hope this thing works. you everything. No, you don't. I'm sorry I couldn't save your sister. I was there. It wasn't your fault. I was paid to protect her and I didn't. She married into a sick family. Maybe. I... I just wanted to say thank you for giving us a chance to live. I mean, as a family. I hope it all works out for you, for all of you. Thank you. Don't be too long. Well, buddy, that's it. Where are you guys gonna go? Uh, I don't know, maybe back to New York. Uh, maybe down to Argentina. Giovanna has family in Salvador. Maybe we'll just stay there. Yeah, I got business to take care of. Look, I I'm sorry I, I dragged you into this. I, I know... Uh, I, I know it was very wrong. It's all right, it's done. But hey, I'm having myself a fun old time. Maybe this is how things had to be. Figure I... Might as well die in the sunshine as die in the snow. Look, I'm sorry I'm leaving. I, I got a kid coming, you know? you know how it is. I know how that is. You know, I, I almost didn't say goodbye to you. I said to myself, maybe this guy will put a bullet in me. <laughs> maybe I will. But not right now. Thank you. Trying to look after yourself, Max, huh? Life is worth living. <laughs> if you say so, pal. I thought I was going to have to witness another murder. <laughs> nah. Not him. You ready? I guess. Okay. I've uh, looked through this information you gathered. And it's not very nice. What is it? It's the Ufe. The famous Mr. Becker. Friend of Victor Bronco. <laughs> yes. And a contributor to his campaigns. A government employee, of course. And? A weapons dealer. A murderer. This was known. A dealer in human organs. This wasn't known. A proper gentleman. Mm, sure. So you're gonna bring him down? <laughs> yes, because I want to lose my wife and my children and then get killed myself. All that after watching him walk free. Tell me what has to be done. Well, officially, there's uh, nothing I can do. And unofficially? Well, we can always try something a little more creative. Creative? De Silva had promised me a 10 o'clock showcase. I had to make sure I was on stage and ready for my close-up. Diga a Becker. Que vim para ele. Ah! Tropa, tropa, ei, moça, 
Mano, o que é esse cara aí? Nada tua conta, rapaz. Então vai, vai. Conta o Deus! Meu conta o Deus, mano. Não desgruda dela, meu. Ei, quem é essa cara aí? Convidado nosso. Quebra esse otário aí. Deixa comigo, dá uma lição nele. <risos> então, o pai dela não diz. Patrão, filha da puta! Atrás de inocência! O que é que você vai fazer? Você vai se acontecer ah, com aqui! Você é aqui que você vai se acontecer, caralho! Tá pensando o quê? Ah, onde é que você vem? Ah, ah, fica aí, cara! Ah, eu! Oh, oh, segura a porta aí! Ah, mas... é, eu vi uma outra versão. Mas assim, oh, mas... Valeu, mas eu vi aquela parada lá, hein? Valeu, Question. Answer him! Answer him! What, What are you doing? What? What are you doing here? O que você está fazendo aqui? What are you doing here? I, I don't understand. I can't hear you. What are you What doing, are you here? doing you here? Me in the ear. Hey, answer me! What are you doing here? Back in the precinct after all this time. Time to find out what the hell is going on. Beth, huh? Nothing resembling good times lay beyond that gate, but I was gonna have to face the music. I guess our little stunt helped some other civic-minded people raise valid concerns about community relations. Their faces said it all. I was on their side, but how could they know that? If they came through that door, I'd be leaving as a human shield and never leave them at all. The police arrived just in time. It sounded like all hell was breaking loose. Whatever nonsense De Silva had pulled, it seemed to be working. Prisoners were trapped in here, and more presently, seemed I was too.
The security switch had to be in that booth. That kid had had the right idea. There was no point bouncing bullets off that thing. I decided I'd try to pick up where he left off. Shame to let that RPG go to waste. This nice. The perfect end to a perfect trip. If someone had told me six months ago this was where my life was headed, I'd have ordered a double of whatever they were drinking. Drunk it, then blown my head off. Porra, você tá tentando fazer? Quebra esse... Another dark, rainy night, another police station, another futile crusade for amends. Time moves forward, and nothing changes. Melhor que você, cuzão! Ele me pegou! Ele me pegou! Every bastard in the joint must have known I was on the loose by now. I couldn't afford to waste any more time. Te 
Bicho no inferno! They'd come from the control room. It looked like the security cameras were still running. It looked like the prisoners were giving them a run for their money. That's what happens when you hand some roided up halfwit a commando uniform with special on the front and let him ride around his hometown in a tank playing soldiers. Sooner or later someone's gonna decide he's not so special. There were a bunch more in the elevator tooled up like they were about to roll into Fallujah. 